Hello and welcome to Harry Potter and the Order of the Phoenix. Let's do this. Of another ten year old? <laughs> At least I don't cry in my sleep. Don't kill Cedric! Boo hoo! What are you talking about? Hey! What? What are you doing? I'm not doing anything! Oh, oh shit. Make it stop! Expecto Patronum! Hell yeah! Get away, buddy boy! Expecto Patronum! Danger to the wizarding community. It was self-defense. Hello, Harry. What up, Sirius? The the order managed to get you here safely. Once he got his packing done. See you later, Harry. Yeah. Thanks, Tonks. Welcome to number 12, Grimmauld Place. Headquarters of the Order of the Phoenix. The Order of the what? It's a secret society. The people who fought against Voldemort last time. Let me show you around. What have you been doing? I've been doing nothing. You've had all the fun here at the headquarters of the Order. It's not that exciting. Mostly we've been doing cleaning for Mum. Mrs. Weasley is very keen on cleaning. Could you give me a hand? I have to move all the stuff in this room against that wall so Mum can clean the floor. It's okay, Harry. You're not at the Dursleys now. You're allowed to use magic. I recommend using Accio and Depulso. Handy, but I've not learnt those spells yet. Just copy me. Let's practice Accio first. I'll use that chair to show you how. First, you need to aim at the chair. Then move your wand like this. Then say, Accio. Accio. Mm. Accio, that's it. Now show me again. Excellent! Now just show Ginny once more. That'll speed things up. I might actually get finished before tea now. Accio is great for pulling objects. Depulso is what you need for pushing. All you have to do is aim, move your wand like this and say, Depulso. Depulso. Depulso! That's it! It's good to be casting some magic. Push it real good. So, we need to move everything from over here to over there. That's right. Huh. Why are you pulling it, Jenny? I'm moaning for five minutes. Have you seen Ron or Hermione? Mum gave us all things to do. They're about somewhere. Let's find them. See you, Ginny. How was your summer? I bet your summer's been better than mine. Stuck at the Dursleys. Dumbledore made us swear not to write. He seemed to think it best. He was really angry when he heard about the Dementors. If I hadn't been stuck at the Dursleys, maybe that wouldn't have happened. Molly drafted you into domestic duties too, Hermione? I'm fixing these. Then we'll give you a hand. Reparo is the spell for this job. Here, 
Just watch me. Aim at the thing that's broken. Then you move your wand like this and say, Reparo! Reparo! Reparo. Reparo! Great. Let's repair the next Good. Let's get this place tidied up before Molly starts moaning again. <laughs> Let me give you a hand. Creature wouldn't let another house elf sully his beloved mistress's house. Who's Creature? A foul waste of house elf skin. <laughs> Your other friends will want to see you. Let's find them. What happened with those Dementors? I thought you'd be safe around Muggles. Lucky Lupin taught you Expecto Patronum. Yeah, that's me, Lucky. Lucky I'm going to get expelled from Hogwarts for stopping a Dementor from kissing me. You'll be back at Hogwarts soon enough. Not with the time it's taken me to pack, we won't. Then let us give you a hand. Wingardium Leviosa. The lifting spell. Watch closely. Aim your wand at the clothes, and then move it like this. Wingardium Leviosa! Now they're in the air, we can move the clothes around like this. To drop the clothes in the trunk, just break the spell. Wingardium Leviosa! Good cast! Tying up, nice one, hell man. yeah. Can't believe Ron can't put his own damn clothes away, but... Well, Good shit. Cast. You've got it! Now, let's get everything else packed up. Woo! Thanks. I don't know how stuff gets that spread out. Wingardium Leviosa. Useful for moving things around and for keeping Ron's socks at arm's length. Hermione's been reading up. She says they can't expel you. Yeah. What were the Dementors doing there anyway? That is a very good question. I have to go to a meeting of the Order. You stay and catch up with your friends, Harry. I wonder if this meeting's important. Let's find the others. Good evening. Everyone's expecting you. They're through here. Is that Muto? You think of what I'm thinking. We can use the invisibility cloak, but it's still getting difficult to maintain a proper guard. You know the importance Voldemort places on us. We must find a way. Voldemort's after some sort of weapon. Maybe it's something that can kill lots of people. Shh, the meeting's finished. Quick, get to bed before Mum catches us. I hope our side's got it, whatever it is. Almost there, Harry. Courtroom 10, a full wizard gamot, and for a simple case of underage magic. Order, order! All those in favor of conviction! We also wish to welcome our new defense against the dark arts teacher, Professor Dolores Umbridge, <coughs> who... Thank you, Headmaster. The Minister for Magic has always considered education to be of vital importance. Although progress for progress sake must be discouraged. She's a friend of Fudge's. She was at the hearing. Be old. Most illuminating. It's a load of what? There's important stuff in this book, Practices. 
Thank you, Professor Umbridge, and to you and all newcomers. Welcome to Hogwarts. That's a cool camera shot. Listen, Ron. Well done, mate. Becoming a prefect. I never thought it'd be me. I thought it'd be you. Nah. I've caused too much trouble. Yeah, I suppose. Come on, we better get to the common room. I can't believe what's doing space around here. I'm going to get a job at the ministry with. Hey, Harry! Have you two noticed Hagrid's not here? You must be doing something for the order. Keep your voice down. <laughs> Quiet, George. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, if you don't hurry up, you'll be finding Hermione in a bad mood. So, what can we do? Not the brightest, is he? I solemnly swear he isn't the brightest. Oh yeah, the Marauders map. I solemnly swear that I am up to no good. Mischief managed. You better get upstairs. No one mind is like you're late. Damn, this is cool as hell. Bye. Hi, Harry. Uh, hi, Joe. Well, uh, I just thought I'd say hello. Did you have a good summer? I mean, apart from the hearing and almost being expelled. Uh, is that a tornado's badge? You don't support them, do you? Yeah, I do. I'll see you later, Harry. People only started supporting the Tornadoes when they won the league. Let's get to the common room. Password? I don't know it. Do you? I thought you did. Aren't prefects told in advance? Yeah, it, it was something to do with, you know, uh... Um, <laughs> I don't know. They told us loads of stuff. Great. So how do we get it? <laughs> Jesus new Christ. Password, new entry. Yeah, of course. Come on. Let's find someone else from Gryffindor and ask them the password. Hi. Do you know what the password is for the common room? Uh, Mimbulus Mimbletonia? Good. You passed my prefect test. Now move it, midget. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Password! Mimbulus Mimbletonia. Correct. It was so. Where have you two been? You'd better look at the notice board. And they the chocolate. Unbelievable, isn't it? Yeah. I can't believe we got double potions on a Monday. We better find Neville. I bet he's not looked at the timetable yet. And we've got Umbridge for defense against the dark arts next. Maybe this is a time to check your map. Lady, I may be, but he is no gentleman. Okay, Harry. Hiya. Huh. Pointing that wand at me. Something's there to get himself in trouble. Point your wand at them. Beast. There's loads of Hey! Can't tell my father. You think we're scared? <laughs> Professor Vetch is supposed to be really strict. I'm not... Thanks. I tried to stop them picking on some first years, but they started picking on me instead. At least you tried, Neville. Wasn't that against school rules, Hermione? We'd better get to defense against the dark arts. The fact that there's no load screens in a game from 2007 is freaking crazy. What the way, gentlemen? Ordinary. Wizard. 
Electricity. Level. Examinations. O. W. L. Study hard and you will be rewarded. Fail to do so and the consequences may be severe. There's nothing in here about actually using defensive spells. <laughs> using spells? I can't imagine why you would need to use defensive spells. Oh, I don't know. Maybe because Lord Voldemort's back. That is a lie. It's not a lie. I saw him. I fought him. A detention, Mr. Potter? Tonight, my office. Now, everyone read chapter one. Basics for beginners. Well, that was fun. I can't believe she won't let us practice spells in OWLs here. That's what you're upset about. Not that a teacher is telling everyone I'm a liar. We could talk to Fred and George. They've already done fifth year defense against the dark arts. Those two? They only know flashy stuff, not real magic. We've got nothing to lose though, have we? Come on, let's find them. Looks like the hallway in the Chamber of Secrets where the blood was written on the wall. Like I'm listening. Oh, there they are. What is it you want to ask us? It's Umbridge. She won't teach us anything practical in defense against the dark arts. We heard. So you want our help? What do you think, George? I think with this sorry lot, we better start with the basics. One's out, everyone. Now, the best sort of opponent is a oneless opponent. Care to demonstrate, George? I'd be delighted, Fred. Watch closely now. Expelliarmus! Exemplary, George. I'd almost think you'd been awake in class. <laughs> <laughs> now let's see you do it, Harry. Expelliarmus! So now try nice. to get those two. Now you've got it. Well done! You even got Ron to cast it correctly. Get lost. <laughs> now, Expelliarmus is all right, but when it comes to wiping the smile off the face of a Slytherin, there's nothing quite as good as Stupefy, as Fred will demonstrate. Stupefy! Not bad. Now, let's see you do it, Harry. Just imagine I'm Malfoy. Stupefy! Oh, so now try teaching those two. Now you've got it. Superfly. Not bad. Not bad at all. Now, if you'll excuse us. We're busy men. We've got place to go, people to see. You should keep practicing those spells when you get a chance. But who should we practice on? Oh, any passing Slytherin will do. <laughs> see you later. Harry, hadn't you better go to your detention? We'll meet you when you get out of Umbridge's office. Yeah. See you later. Looking for trouble, Potter. Hell yeah. Stupefy. <laughs> you won't win. Die. Good evening, Mr. Potter. You know why you are here? Yes, for telling the truth. I'll decide what the truth is. I must not tell lies. Ah! What's that in your hand? I thought you said Umbridge gave you lines. Let's talk to Hermione. She'll know something to help heal your hand. Oh. Hermione. Look what Umbridge made Harry do. That woman really is a monster. You've got to tell Dumbledore about this. No, I'm not giving Umbridge the satisfaction. Well, a solution of strained and pickled Mertlap tentacles will help to soothe the wound, but I need to check how to extract it. Let me guess. We have to go to the library. 
It's not as though you're actually allergic to books, Ron. <laughs> hey! There's shit all over the place. God damn, this place is huge. I've been far now, are we? The book we need is in here somewhere. There it is! Up there! That's the book we need! How am we supposed to get up there? I don't remember McGonagall teaching us how to turn into birds. Have an excellent day today. Anyone got a net? <laughs> damn books flying away on us. Freaking troll. I'm gonna end up smacking some people in the face with this table. <laughs> Shit, finally. Damn troll book. This isn't the right book. This is from the restricted section. It must have escaped. Let's get to somewhere private where we can check this book. How about moaning Myrtle's bath? That would be perfect. Oh shit. I can't see why it would be in the restricted section. It looks like a normal book on the practical use of spells. That's it then. Practical use. I bet Umbridge had it put there to stop us practicing any more spells. Come on, Harry, let's choose one to learn. Uh. Well, here's a good one to start with. Incendio! It says here that you need to aim your wand, then simply tap it, like this, and use the incantation... Incendio. Incendio! Blimey! Incendio! Great! Try lighting another one! Brilliant! Incendio! Let's practice on the lamps in here. Go on, Harry. Don't put the lights on! I've got a headache! <laughs> Jesus. Hi, Myrtle. This book is really useful. Are you going to make us take it back or what? Library books are meant to be borrowed, so it's not as if we're doing anything wrong. I'll keep hold of it. Let's get back to the common room. We need to get ready for our Hogsmeade visit. Serious? So Umbridge is causing trouble. She's not letting us use magic. That's because Fudge thinks Dumbledore is using Hogwarts to form a wizard army. <sighs> Someone's coming. Sorry, you're on your own. Blimey. Great. Voldemort's on the move and Fudge is as good as helping him. What are we supposed to do? We've got to be able to defend ourselves. And if Umbridge refuses to teach us how, we need someone who will. Who'd want to be taught by me? Facing this stuff in real life, it isn't like school. When you're a second away from being murdered, or watching a friend die right before your eyes. You're right, Harry. That's why we need your help. Because if we're to have any chance of beating Voldemort... Signed up. We need to find Neville. Let's find Neville. Neville Longbottom? What the hell is he doing? Incendio! Hi, Neville. Nice plant. I don't know what's gone wrong. 
I mix some dragon dung with a few fertilizers. Dragon dung? The little snare won't stop growing. Professor Sprout will go mad. We'll help you sort it out. Oh, thanks, Harry. I've been using Incendio to burn it away, but I can't cast it fast enough for my own. Then let's see what four of us can do. Okay. Keep casting. We've got at least half of it now. Almost through to the door. Keep going. We've done it. There's some more inside. We haven't done it. Oh, jeez. We're almost there. Harry, I thought I was done for. That's all right, Neville. Did Hermione tell you I'd found a place for the DA to practice? Yeah, where is it? On the seventh floor, the room of requirement. Just follow me. All right. Let's go, it's on Neville. The floor. Follow me. It's here. Where? You've really got to need it. Just think how much we need a room to practice in. We need to show that Toad Umbridge. I need to show people how to fight toad. against Voldemort. See? I told you. Oh. wants us to fight back. All we need to do now is find the others and tell them where the room is. Then we can start to practice. I put the list of DA members on the notice board. We can see who's left to find. We can find them all in the Marauder's map. Just look for anyone in the DA and we can start with them. I've been trying to learn Protego, but I can't seem to get it right. Could you teach it to us? Yes, of course I will, Neville. Hermione, have you got the spell book? It can be tricky. Let's see if the book gives any hints. Right. You need to point your wand, then move it like this. Protego! Okay, Neville. Let me show you. Just do as I do. Protego! Stupid boy! Wait! Just once more, then I'm sure I'll remember it. Show me again, Harry. No. Well done, Neville. I never thought I could do it. Let's look at the DA list and decide who to find next. You know how annoying this would be if you were trying to get to class and you were late? Holy shit. Damn. Hell yeah. Hello? Hermione? Hermione Angelina. Some Slytherins have smashed up the trophy room and they've gone for Filch. I'm locked in. We'd better get her out. If Filch catches her, Umbridge will ban Gryffindor from playing Quidditch forever. And that would be the end of the world, wouldn't it? <laughs> Come on, let's find a way to get Angelina out. Wingardium Leviosa! Double door chair, just fucking chuck it somewhere. Hey, Angelina. Harry, about time too. I thought you'd left me. Malfoy took my wand. We need to clear everything up before those sliverings come back with Filch. Come on, quick. This one goes into gold. Have you been practicing without telling us? Filch will go mad if he sees this mess. This one goes in the gold. That's it. Keep casting. <laughs> if only they hadn't taken my wand. Wingardium Leviosa! I got a hell yeah, we'll repair the glass. If we get caught, we'll never be allowed to play Quidditch again. 
She's in here. Got you. What's the problem, Mr. Filch? I don't know what's been going on here, but I'm keeping my eye on all of you lot. Thanks, Harry. That's okay. We found somewhere for the DA to practice. Up on the seventh floor. That's great. I'll bring Alicia and Katie with me. See you later. Susan, we should tell her about the room of requirement. What's she doing with Crab and Goyle? You think you're special just because your aunt's in the ministry. My father reckons your aunt's a troublemaker. Some oh, teach her damn. a lesson. Freaking assholes. Harry! Ron! Hey! Harry, please help! Oh, look! They've come to save their little friend. Come on then, Potter. What are you gonna do? How can we get past? You'll have to use your wand. Let's jinx the toe rags. We have to get them away from Susan so we can talk to her. Dummy, take this, you did not very well. asshole. Thanks. You were brilliant. Don't worry. I'm sure you do the same for us. I wish I was as good as you at dueling. Then you should come to our DA meeting. It's on the seventh floor in the room of requirement. Great. I like the camera angles, but the way the switch is on you, and then you have to push the other key to go... The other way is kind of wonky. It's a lot of fucking steps. We've been looking for you two. We found somewhere for the DA to practice. I hope you're not breaking school rules. We wouldn't dream of it, would we, Fred? Not with so many prefects around. <laughs> We're merely storing items where they won't disturb oversensitive individuals. Like Umbridge and Filch. Will you give us a hand? We need someone to go up inside the boathouse. We'll lift the boxes up to you. Then if you can pop them in the boat, it'll be much appreciated. And it's Harry Potter. He's past the starting line. He's climbing up the ladders. You need to lift the cover off each boat. Pop the boxes inside and cover them up. Then put the cover back and it's mission accomplished. OK, Harry, we'll pass the boxes up. Just put them in the boat. Brilliant. Right. Cool. That's the way! No problem! Do they actually have the actors voice these characters? Because they sound like exactly Almost like them. There. Keep going! Done it! We knew you wouldn't let us down! Wingardium Leviosa! Right! Brilliant! Okay, now cover the box up with the tarpaulin. Accio! Brilliant! Come on down! I think he's earned a reward. How about a little preview? Careful! Ron and Hermione might have to put us in detention. <laughs> what is in those boxes? Want to find out? Oop. Then cast Reducto or Incendio on that box. Yeah. Think of it as helping us with our research. <laughs> Here 
Hell yeah. <laughs> Amazing! Glad you think so. You just proved the fireworks are idiot proof. We better go. See you at the DA meeting. Seventh floor, room of requirement. Cool. We'll be there. Hey, Harry! What up, Jenny? Umbra just confiscated some of Fred and George's things. Filch thinks they're bottles of love potion. What are Fred and George doing with love potion? It's not love potion, you troll. It's doxy venom <laughs> for the skiving snack boxes. We've got to get those bottles back, or Fred and George will be expelled. They're in Umbridge's storeroom. Harry, can you use your invisibility cloak to get the bottles back? I'll fetch it from the boys' dormitory. I love this thing. Now, remember. Woo! I'm invisible! I'm chattering, Ron. Me? You're the one who can't go more than 20 seconds without telling someone off. We shouldn't try to cast spells while we're under here. There's not enough room. Someone will see us. I hope she doesn't make us clean any more vases. I know. I see one more vase. I'll be sick. How are we going to get past them? We'll have to find a way to distract them. Something that gets them away from Umbridge's door. Why did that fall off? <laughs> Reparo! I hope she didn't hear that. What is that? <laughs> Damn, she's in here and shit. This is sketch. Look at all this stuff. It's a wonder there are still things left to confiscate. How are we going to find the bottles in all this? Accio, Doxy Venom! Yeah, that's, that's what I was going to do. <sighs> Let's get out of here. I wish we could get a bigger cloak. Well shit, there's only one in existence, bro. Great! I'll return them to Fred and George. And tell them to be more careful. It's not that I approve, but I wouldn't want them to be expelled. It's not them being expelled that would be bad. It'd be the howl as Mum would send. Yeah. Ronald Weasley, how dare you let your brothers be expelled from school? I'll see you at the DA meeting. Isn't that Anthony? Let's tell him. I heard you found somewhere for the DA to meet. What? This is supposed to be secret. It's all right. I heard it from Ernie, who heard it from Neville. We'll see you there then. Yeah? How do I find the room of requirement? Come to the seventh floor and think about how much you really need to find the room, and the door will appear. Uh, okay. I don't know if Terry or Michael knows. You better tell them. See you. This is my favorite courtyard in Hogwarts. Holy shit, it's so beautiful. There's Terry. We should tell them about the meeting. I heard you found someone for the DA to meet. Does everyone know about our secret meeting place? Uh... Did you kill a basilisk with the sword from Dumbledore's office? We're learning how to use spells, not swords. Oh, okay. I don't know if Michael or Anthony knows where to meet. You better tell them. See you later. Okay. Damn, this is cool. There's Ernie. We haven't told him about the DA meeting yet. Ernie! What up, Ern? Hey, Ernie! we found somewhere for the DA to practice. Sorry, I can't come just now. I'm trying to get Snape's homework done. Have you completed yours yet? Which one? We have to procure the ingredients for tomorrow's lesson. Oh, honestly, Harry, haven't you found them yet? And when am I supposed to do that? I've got all my other homework, Umbridge's attentions, and I'm teaching you Defense Against the Dark Arts. No need to be so irritable. Listen, you find five moly plants on a mandrake root, and I'll find the other potion ingredients for you. Where am I supposed to find those things? Well... Professor Sprout has mandrakes in the Herbology greenhouse, and moly plants grow in the castle grounds, so we just have to look for those. Does she know everything? Are you going to get those moly things, Harry? That's one moly plant, Harry. Now we need four more. So that's a moly plant. I wonder what it was I put in my potion last lesson. Oh, Ron. No wonder your potion turned orange. Better than Goyle's. He's burned a hole in his cauldron. Jesus. Great. Now we only need three more plants. Are you going to get those moly things, Harry? 
Brilliant, Harry. We only need two more. I know Harry and I haven't taken arithmetic like you, Hermione. We can count to five. This would be a good place to look. That's four plants. We still need one more, though. What's all those moly plant things? But we've still got to get that mandrake root. Snake never gives us easy homework, does he? We'll have to go to the herbology greenhouses. I think most of playing this game is honestly just walking through the castle. It takes forever to get somewhere, but it really shows you how much it would take if you were actually at the school to get anywhere. Isn't that Michael Cool? Hi, is it true there's a DA meeting later? Try saying it louder. I don't think Malfoy heard you. Sorry, can't wait for the meeting. I don't know if Terry or Anthony knows. You'd better tell them. We've already told them. I'll tell Ginny if I see her. See you in the room of requirement. Do you have to get so many people involved in the DA, Hermione? We should be glad so many people are prepared to do it. Although, Michael probably wouldn't have come along if Ginny wasn't going out with him. She's what? <laughs> She's going out with... Since when? She got together with Michael Jesus. at the end of last year. I don't like him. Big surprise. <laughs> That's the mandrake root there. Blimey. Those things are actually louder than Ginny during a Quidditch match. We'll need earmuffs, Harry. There will be some in the greenhouse somewhere. Ah, oh, they're right here. You'll need those things, mate. Remember what happened to Neville in the second year? We can take things off now. <laughs> Fat ass mandrake. What? We can take these off now! No need to shout. Five moly plants and some mandrake root. Tremendous. If you leave them with me, I'll get them ready for the lesson. Great. See you in the room of requirement for the DA meeting. Damn, we way out in the forest now. What's Looney Lovegood staring at? Ronald, that is rude, okay? Ron, have you come to feed the Thestrals? What's a Thestral? Up there. Luna, we found somewhere for our defense against the Dark Arts group to meet. I can't come until the foal has been fed. It's really shy, though. Don't think it'll come down until the big ones do. Okay, let's feed them. We'll have to get the food to the highest point in the clearing. Oh, shit. Wingardium Leviosa! Need some help. If we can get the meat to the top, I'm sure the pestles will come down. Now what are you doing? Wingardium Leviosa! Need some help. Look, they're starting to come down. They must be able to smell the blood. Are you going to be able to come to the DA meeting then? Whatever you want to do. She's balmy. Do we really need her help? Hi, Padma, Pavati, uh... Can you make it to a DA meeting later? Well, we're supposed to be meeting Professor Trelawney. She's going to interpret a dream I had. Well, can you come after that? I don't know. Meet us at Divination and we can tell you then. Bye. Bye. What was that about? Don't ask me. Padma's been funny with me ever since the Yule Ball. She's still upset because you didn't dance with her. She's not said anything. <laughs> oh, Ron. With girls, it's what we don't say that matters. You should write a book. Translating mad things girls do so boys can understand them. <laughs> Hi. Hey.
Hey, Harry. You ready to come to the meeting? We haven't been in yet. That toad, Umbridge, is in there with Professor Trelawney. <laughs> Umbridge has had Everybody's it in for Professor Trelawney ever since that stupid inspection she did. You c can't sack me. I've been here 16 years. Hogwarts is my, my home. <laughs> Surely you should have seen this coming. Looks like your divination class has been cancelled. Poor Professor Trelawney. Count us in for the DA meeting. Anything to show that Umbridge woman. Great. Zachariah Smith. Do we have to tell him where the meeting is? Yes, we need to keep him in the DA now that he knows about it. We've got a meeting later. No, I've got too much work to do, and my schoolwork must come first. I thought you would have understood that. Of course. So, if we help you with your homework, then you'll come to the meeting? What? Shh. I suppose. <laughs> I've got to get a copy of the Monster Book of Monsters first. Okay, fine. We'll get that for you. Hermione! Let's find the Monster Book of Monsters. This is the right section. The Monster Book of Monsters should be around here. That's the book Zacharias wants. Nice one, Harry. Let's what give it to Zacharias. Now, a DA meeting. No way, I'm still knee-deep in work. Yes, but you did say... Get me some Wiganweld potion from the hospital wing, and then I might be able to come. Fine. What the hell, man? Friggin' asshole. Wiganweld potion? I wonder what Zacharias wants it for. Who cares? Let's go to the hospital wing, get it and go. Let's look around for Zacharias's Wigan Whale potion. That's it! I got it! Let's get back to the library and give it to Zacharias. Now, when we go into the library, try to be polite to Zacharias, Ron. Here. I finished that homework ages ago. What I need now is to know when Nearly Headless Nick died. What the fuck? Brindle, so I'm sure you can find out. And if we do, you'll come to the meeting? Yeah, yeah, I suppose so. Have an excellent day today. Oh, Harry, are you looking for me? Sir Nicholas, could you tell us when you died, please? Don't you remember? After all, you did attend my 500th death day party. Oh, yeah, in our second year. Which means you died in 1492. Two. I knew that you would remember, Miss Granger. For some reason, my death day seems to be quite a popular question at the moment. I do hope that means they're thinking about another party. Okay, Zacharias. Sir Nicholas died in 1492. Yes, that's what I thought. You mean you already knew? So, the DA meeting is in a room off the seventh floor corridor. You just have to think about the DA meeting to find the room. Okay, I'll see you there. Alright, well I gotta pause it. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.